Well, this is horrible. What type of secret lair has windows? Well, you know, Oliver said he wanted to do things differently. I think I just saw a cockroach. Listen, about Oliver. Oh, no, look, it's fine. He still thinks we spent the weekend at a spa. But why can't we tell him about Sarah? Sarah, she needs more time, and I don't need Oliver's judgment. Just a couple more days, and she'll be back to herself. I promise. Guessing he didn't tell you what we're doing here either. No, he just had a perma grin on his face the whole way here. Okay, now I'm worried. I said he has some big announcement to make. Oh my God, wait, wh wh where is it? Why aren't you wearing it? Wearing what? Uh, what is it that you wanted to tell us? And why are you telling us here? Remember this office? Yes. This was Sebastian Blood's campaign office. And now it's mine. Anyone who's qualified is afraid to run for a good reason. But I can protect myself. So, I'm running for mayor. <laughs> uh, don't everyone congratulate me at once. Oh, you're serious? Yes. The other week, Lance was saying that this City needs someone to stand up who isn't hiding behind a mask. It, it needs a leader. Well, why does that person have to be you? I mean, don't get me wrong, but you're not a politician. Well, maybe that's the best reason for me to be elected. What are you gonna do for a staff or campaign manager? Money? Money part's taken care of. Palmer Tech has funded enough to kickstart the campaign. The decision I'm sure my board of directors are gonna be thrilled with. <clears throat> what platform are you gonna run on? I'll figure it out. <laughs> what qualifies you to? Be a mayor? I care about the city. But you can't say that you're gonna run because being the green arrow isn't enough. I'm working on that. We are gonna uh -huh. brush up on those answers before the first press conference. Kinda thought everyone would be a little bit more supportive. No, it's not that we're not supportive, Oliver. Just... We just wanna make sure that you're not in over your head. Maybe the other announcement will go over better. Okay. by Blood's campaign office. Blood also needed his own lair. Uh, don't, don't worry, I, I burned a lot of incense. Oliver, how did you? How did you do this all by yourself? Oh, I had help. He had a lot of help. Cisco and Starlabs. Four polycarbonate cases, each key to your individual biometrics. <laughs> God, I didn't even think you could pronounce biometrics. I had some design input. Wow. Oliver, this is amazing. Well, when I set up shop in the foundry, it's just me. That's not the case anymore. So I thought we could use a little more space. What was that? What, what, did it break? Oh, you OK? Yeah, I'm just not used to this chariot. I'm feeding police, emergency services, and homeland security radio transmissions through a processing algorithm 24-7. This way, if anything happens in the city, we will, we will know about it. Two police detectives found shot to death responding to a code three. Um, there's no record of them calling dispatch for backup. Which means either their comms failed or they were ambushed the moment they arrived on the scene. Dan and I would do recon, see if there's anything the CSI missed at the crime scene. All right, I'll talk to Lance. Maybe skip the part about running for mayor because I'm pretty sure you're not gonna have his vote. That'll have to change. Can't run the city without the help of the SCPD. Okay. Mm. What did Thea think that you were wearing? No idea. 